Hello there everybody, today I'm going to be showing you how to put a panorama feature on any iDevice with a camera. I'm particularly using an iPhone 4 here, and uh, one of the first things I'm going to show you what to do is to, uh, very first step would be to back up your iDevice to iTunes, as you can see I've already done here. And your second step is going to be to download a software called iBackupBot. I'm going to leave a link in the description that works for Mac and PC. Then you're going to go ahead and scroll down to your latest backup in the options menu on the left. Then go down to Library, Preferences, Mobile Slideshow. You're going to go ahead and double click that. When a little window pops up, you're going to press Cancel. It's going to take you into some coding. When you get into the coding, you're going to scroll down until you find this space was low. And then you're going to go ahead and press the Enter key on that. Once you press the Enter key, you're going to, head, going to go ahead and type in uh, Key, Enable Fire Break, Close Key, and then string, capital, all caps, yes, and then close string. I'm going to go ahead and leave a subtitle for that also, so you can all read that. And then uh, you're going to go ahead and type that in. Then you're going to press save in the top left, and you're going to press export. And once you press export, you're going to press save. And then after that, it's going to uh, export it back into your file, so it's basically a new version. Uh, a little bit messed up right here, because uh, I didn't actually save the file. But you're going to go ahead and press that little power button that I pressed right here, and you're going to press yes to the save instead of no, because I pressed no because I already have it done. You're going to go ahead and go up to file and press restore and make sure your device is plugged into your computer when you do this. And you're going to press yes. I said no because I've already done this on my uh, iDevice, but after you do that, it's going to sync with iTunes. Everything should work fine. Open up your camera application, hit options, and you're going to have panorama feature there. It's a great way to do it without jailbreaking. It's built into iOS. It works all right, but uh, anyways, guys, this is me, your review from MasterDog3. I'll see you all later. Goodbye.